destroy the world. In 10 days, the galaxy needs its guardians. You said this would be a relaxing holiday. The summer of love. Today, today, it will go down in history. And thunder begins. Today, we'll fight. This is my vow. Oh, God, will die. For you, that may or may not be catastrophic for the whole universe. Thor, Love and Thunder, in theaters July 8th, rated PG-13. I have spent my life trying to protect my family. The children, they have the ability to see. Now, they will come for us. We're now at war. The first nation to harness sight will dominate the world. This new weapon, more powerful than you can imagine. All of fire will be ours. Bomb them. You are my husband. I'm their father. You must decide what is best for us. I will die before I allow anything to happen to you. Happy birthday. Thanks. So what do you guys do tonight? Birthday ritual, scary movie marathon, same as every year. You know, legend has it. It's on the 16th birthday that a witch gets her powers. And another year begins anew. Maiden, mother, and crone too. We call on thee with one request. Help our intentions manifest. Sanderson sisters. I bet you're looking for the stage. Always. The victim's name is Leo Kopernick, sir. Seems he was killed in the costume store. And then he was deposited here. Staged, so to speak. How much longer do you intend to hold us all hostage? Or is that the idea? Gather all the suspects and interrogate each of us in turn until the mystery is solved? Marvin Cochranar's overweighted playwright. Celebrated playwright? Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. I can't read my own handwriting. There was an incident. <laughs> I'll kill you. <gasps> it's as good as a confession. It's not jump to conclusions, Constable. What do we have here? <laughs> Working late, huh? He killed Copernic to hush up the affair. Case closed. I'm doing it again, aren't I, sir? Jumping to conclusions. Yeah. A little bit. You've never heard of Richard Attenborough. A real life detective. I understand that you came to blows the night in question. It was me, Inspector. I arrest you for the murder of Leo no, Copernic. No, no. We have a serial killer on the loose. He keeps the key ah! under the mat. We are no longer merely suspects. We are also potential victims. So what did he do that made you suspicious? It wasn't so much what he did, it was more the way he did it. How did he do it? Sort of. you and like bags of people. Surprise! Harley, she's head of the suicide squad. 
You never returned my email. Why are you stirring up drama right now? This is not drama, okay? What's she gonna do? She's wearing a pencil skirt. Harley and Ivy are back! Let the eat bang kill tour begin. BFFGFFs, right? Oh, Ivy! <laughs> Look radiant! Aw, oh, thanks. We've been doing a ton of banging. And I'm only doing good when I'm having fun. It's only the beast I've done. It's so fun. And then raunchy. <laughs> and then a little scary. Don't give a damn for my reputation. Oh, that's terrifying! Oh, my God. Shall I continue? It's not worth it. Let the grand orgy begin! <gasps> Please, James Gunn, sit on me. Oh, there it is. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you are gonna cream when you hear this plan. It would make Lex Luthor shit his pants. And that man does not shit his pants for anything. Let's go! And why are you all coming to the world's greatest camp for two weeks? Because, because I'm a secret, secret celebrity! <laughs> I was actually looking for, because we all love each other, and, you know, something, something, wildcats! Welcome, folks. I'm just gonna need to collect your phones, snacks, and all electronic devices. It's only for two weeks, but Sasha doesn't know that. Sasha is your phone. I this summer, Camp Shallow Lake has been selected for a very special opportunity to tell you all about it. Mr. Corbin Blue! You guys are gonna be the first camp to put on Frozen! Surprise! Best summer ever. It's my first camp. Should we spread out our bed assignments or do the new girl cluster? My first boyfriend. Just hitting me now that you two are gonna be a thing all summer. My first time really going out for the lead in a show. It is time to introduce you to your director, EJ Caswell. It just freaking out a little bit. Shake your money maker, Caswell. Show me how you feel. Let's start, start, start the party. I cannot focus on anything but auditions right now. What are the two main guys' names in Frozen again? One is, I want to say, Gary. None of them are Gary. You can't just Zephron your way through auditions this time. I promise you, the best is yet to come. Scream! What's up, Wildcat? Feels like these last few years have been leading up to something big. Nothing is going to ruin our perfect summer together. <laughs> what, what? <laughs> one could say the stakes have never been higher. And one will. The stakes have never been higher. We're gonna get back to 1988. Who's there? What are you doing in my house? What are you doing in my house? That's her. Holy shit. Okay, this isn't real. This isn't real. This, this is real. Oh. Hey, Rick, are you following what's happening in Thailand? Some kids stuck in a cave. We're on the list of rescue divers. It's just a tourist cave. It looks easy, but when it's flooded, it's impassable. It takes a certain kind of mindset for the deep cave diving. You have to be a bit nuts. They're very, very dangerous. The high water level and the low visibility. Barely shoulder wide, pulling against very strong currents. Last seen nine days ago, 12 boys and their coach are trapped in the flooded caves. 
Hello? Hey. They're here. How many of you? Thirteen. Thirteen? They're all alive. Uh, can we go out now? You're talking about a five-hour dive. You try and dive those kids the whole way, all you'd be bringing out is dead bodies. With oxygen running low, the entire nation is anxiously waiting for what will happen next. What are you thinking? Just a crazy idea. We've got a skill none of the rest of us have. No. It's insane. It's unethical. It's illegal. The man's already died. Breathe. We do nothing. We'll be bringing him out dead for sure. So you are expecting casualties? Yes. I expect casualties. Johnny, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Just give me a minute. Please. Okay, we can make it.